So right now we're looking at my OneDrive and what I want to do is go to Project 2 and share that with one of my coworkers. So what I'm going to do is click right next to the file to select it. At the top of my menu I have Share. I'm going to click Share. Now I can enter in the name or email address of the person. So in this instance I'm going to share with T Mills at SAISD.net. I found her. I can see underneath her position she's a coordinator. Make sure that this is a, an employee of the district because it's also possible to share with a student. The student will list what grade number they are underneath. So I'm clicking on her to select her. Also next to her name it says can edit. I can decide whether she can edit or if she can just view the file. If I only want to give her access to just look at it and not make any changes then I can say Tanya Mills can view. I can add a message here if I would like to. I can click share and in her email she will get access to this file. Additionally I can also just get a link and if I click get link I can say that it's a view link that's restricted to an SAISD employee or an edit link. Let's say I want to get a view link. I go to create and I would just right click and say copy and now I can go paste that inside of an email. The third option right here says shared with and currently you can see myself, Tanya Mills and Sonia Obergon are two other people that are able to view. If later I want to decide that one of these employees can no longer edit or view, I can click right here and I can say change to view only or stop sharing. And those are just a few ways for you to share your files.